And now, the Mickey Mouse Club presents Annette. Today's episode, Paying the Piper. Hi, gang. Hi, Steady. Hello. Hello. Say, haven't we met someplace before? Mm-hmm. The other day when I first arrived. Oh, yeah, that's right. You were looking for an address on Elm. I take it you found it all right. It was my aunt and uncle's address. I'm Annette McLeod. So you're Annette McLeod. Well, I guess I owe you an apology. What for? For standing you up. I'm Steve Abernathy. Oh, I'm pleased to meet you again, Steve. Then you accept my apology? It wasn't your fault. Well, remind me never to do it again, will you? Come on in, I'll introduce you to the gang. Kids, I want you to meet a friend of mine. This is Annette McLeod, a recent and I might add most attractive addition to our fair city. Annette, this is Kitty Blaylock, Madge Markham, Jimmy Hello. Smith, Hi. Drew Stafford, Hi. Tony Blair, Pat Boron, and Court Whitney. Hi. And I believe you've already met Moselle Corey. Oh, yes, we met the other day. I was wondering when you were going to get here. All the kids have been dying to meet you. Well, isn't anybody going to introduce me? Oh, Laura, I'm sorry. Laura Rogan, this is Annette McLeod. Oh, yes, the country cousin. I understand you're from Gopher Junction. It's Beaver Junction. Go for beaver weasel. I knew it was some kind of a rodent. Oh, come now, Laura. A weasel's not a rodent. Oh, Stevie, you're so cute. You know I don't know anything about botany. You mean zoology, don't you? <laughs> Stephen, must you get technical? Well, what are we waiting for? I thought we were going to play spin the bottle. We are. Here's the bottle. OK, everybody get their number. All right, now let's all adjourn to the patio. Come on. Wait, let me have you. You know how to play, don't you? I'm not sure. We used to play back home when we were little, but I've sort of forgotten. Oh, there's nothing to it. We sit around in a circle, and the leader spins a bottle and calls a number. The one whose numbers call has to stop the bottle before it stops spinning, or else he pays a forfeit. Oh, now I remember. Come on. All right, all set? All right, and I'm it. OK, let's go. OK, ready? Number 16, come and get it. Oh, that's me. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you goofed. Forfeit. All right, so I have to pay a forfeit. What'll it be? How about that necklace? Oh, trust you to pick the most expensive thing I've got. Daddy bought it to me from Paris last year for my birthday. Hey, it looks like the real McCoy. Well, of course it's the real thing. What did you think it was? Costume jewelry? OK, OK, so it's 14 karat solid gold. I'll just put it on the piano till we're ready to pay off. OK, you're it. 17. <laughs> <laughs> I guess that makes you it again, huh? You goon, you did that on purpose. <laughs> 22. Oh, forfeit. 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 <laughs> well, what do you have to forfeit? I don't know. Oh, don't be naive. Anything will do. It doesn't matter. A, a necklace, a bracelet. Oh, you don't have any jewelry, do you? How about a corsage, Laura? Oh, yes, I'm sorry. I didn't notice. Well, that'll be fine. Just set it there on the piano next to my necklace. Here, let me get it. Well, now you're it. Well, what are you waiting for? Spin the bottle. Fifteen. Aha, <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh, big joke. Big joke. I'm Stan. Whatever happened to you? Oh, that dumb game. What game? Oh, there ought to be a law against such slippery floors. I could have knocked my teeth down my throat. Olmstead, whatever are you talking about? Oh, that dumb game we've been playing, spin the bottle. I tripped and did a header. 
Oh, I'm so sorry. It's beginning to swell. I hope you aren't going to have a black eye. Now, you wait. I'll get a piece of steak and... I haven't got time now. I'll eat it later. We're going to redeem our forfeits, and i got to get my shoes back before I wreck my socks. Poor Olmstead, you always manage to get into trouble. All right, kids, let's go. I'm ready. Quiet. Silence in the courtroom. Is everybody ready to redeem their forfeits? Yes, yeah. sir. Sure. Here's the cards. Okay, Val, you draw the numbers. First number, 16. Will number 16 please step forward? Oh, so you're number 16. Let me see, your forfeit was... Ah, yes. Okay, Drew. Heavy, heavy hangs over your head. Fine or super fine? Super fine. What shall she do to redeem it? She'll sing reading, writing, and rhythm again. Oh, you wretch. <laughs> Vacation's almost over, we'll soon be going back to school. But before we do, let's all review this elementary rule. Reading, writing, and rhythm, they're the three Cute song. of today. Mm -hmm. She hasn't got a bad voice, either. Laura's loaded with talent. She's pretty, isn't she? Her male population seems to think so. Especially one of them. And you're on your swing and way. Reading, writing, and rhythm. They're the three R's today. Okay, Val, who's next? Fifteen. Oh, oh you. <laughs> Heavy, heavy hangs over your head. Fine or super fine? About size 12 and a half. What shall he do to redeem his forfeit? Stand on his head and do a jig. Ah, oh, <laughs> very funny. Do you know any jig tunes? Of course. You ready? All set. OK, let's go. <laughs> 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 Boy, that sure made me hungry. When do we eat? Oh, don't you ever think of anything but food? <laughs> Who's next? Twenty-two. Well, 22, isn't that you? Oh, it is. Well, go on, don't be bashful. Heavy, heavy hangs over your head. Fine or super fine? Super, super fine. What shall she do to redeem it? How about another song? Oh, no, I don't sing very well. Oh, sure you can. It's all in fun. Shall I sing my favorite? Oh, sing anything. It doesn't matter. Here, sit down. Oh, I'm sorry. I don't play the piano. Oh, for heaven's sakes, what can you do? Oh, but then I don't suppose it's your fault. I don't imagine Gopher Junction's exactly a cultural center. Laura. It's called How Will I Know My Love. It sounds good. Go ahead. Yes, for heaven's sakes. Let's get this silly game over before supper's announced. I'll follow you on my harmonica. Oh, that'll be fine. Can you Whipper get? Will Laura, give shh, a please. Sign. How will I know he's mine? How will I know my love? When he Come on, everybody! Soup's on! Pine wood. Oh, 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 Thank goodness supper was announced, so we didn't have to listen to any more of that dull song she was trying to sing. I'll get you something to eat. 
there before everything's gone. Next episode, The Missing Necklace.